New information now about another sex offender off the streets. This man, Lawrence Avia, now under arrest thanks to an alert parole officer in Denver. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez live at 5th and Federal where the arrest went down. And Lance, you've learned that both the suspect and that parole officer had stun guns. You might say that the parole officer was quicker on the draw, John. He uh, deployed his stun gun first and was able to take that suspect into custody on that sidewalk behind me after a short foot chase. Southbound on federal, southbound on federal. Good to secure my car. You can hear the parole officer breathing hard during that chase. He was in this area checking up on another parolee when he spotted Lawrence Avila with two women near this broken down van. Police say Avila removed his ankle monitor back in December and was wanted for failing to register as a sex offender. Authorities say Avila took off running when the officer spotted him. He caught up with him behind this 7-Eleven at 5th and Federal. That's when Avila apparently pulled out a stun gun, then dropped it. You see it here on the ground. The officer didn't drop his. Police initially cuffed the two women who were with Avila, but later released them, saying there was no evidence they knew that Avila was a wanted man. We checked and found he has an eight-page rap sheet, which includes a 1993 conviction of sexual assault on a child. He has been arrested numerous times since then for failing to register as a sex offender. And we are told that Avila is being held in the Denver County Detention Center on a hold for both Lakewood and Jefferson County. In West Denver, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.